welcome all of you to this video in the previous video we saw some interesting examples based on the area formula of the sector of a circle today in this video we will see what common mistakes occur while solving these type of questions the length of the minute hand of a clock is 10 cm the minute hand moves from 420 to 440 minutes can you now find the area covered by the minute hand also find out what will be the area of the remaining portion left on the clock here use the value of pi as 3.14 Pause the video to solve the question and then match your answer. Let's discuss option 1. We know that the angle formed by the minute hand in 1 minute is 6 degrees and here it says that the minute hand moves 20 mark to 40 minutes which means that it covers a total of 20 minutes. So the angle made by the minute hand in 20 minutes would be 120 degrees. This diagram shows the minor sector of a circle. By solving for the area of minor sector putting theta and r in the formula the area of minor sector obtained as 104.66 square cm we see that apart from minor sector we have the area of major sector left let a be the area of the major sector to determine the value of which from the area of the whole circle the area of minor sector is subtracted on solving this the value of a found to be 209.33 square centimeters therefore we can say that the area of major sector will be 209.33 square centimeters hence Option 1 is the correct answer. If you have selected option 2, it is a good try. But that is the wrong answer because when you find the area of the major sector that is a then the value of theta is put as 240 instead of 120 because in place of the minor sector you considered the remaining angle. and forget that you have to subtract the area of the minor sector from the total area for which you have to take the value of theta as 120 degrees only but you did not do that due to which the value of a derived by you is 104.66 square cm which is incorrect If you have selected option 3 it is a good try but this is also the wrong answer because since without finding the value of angle of the minor sector as 120 degrees and put the value of angle as 20 degrees in the formula of the area of the sector and solve it further which gives the incorrect value of the minor sector and on the basis of that you also determine the area of major sector because of which your answer is incorrect so hopefully you must have understood why the first option is right in this example and why the others are wrong teachers can also test the understanding of students in the class with the help of some such examples